Good afternoon, friends. Well, we got a saw here that we haven't had out for a while, and I kind of want to give it another chance because I really like the guy who built it. Uh, as most of the saw community knows, this whole thing about this, it's all new to me. I, I, I don't ever remember <laughs> ever in my career uh, thus far people kibitzing over power saws more than the internet. I've just never experienced it until I come here. Now, I like I said, I really like the guy that built this saw. The guy that built it. Um, he's a friend of mine. I talked to him. I'm actually talking to him about, because I'm a husky guy, about building me a low back. Because I don't, I don't like, I don't, this isn't my gig. I, I don't. Anyways. I'm a low back guy, but what I just noticed about this saw now, I, cause I kind of had concerns about this saw, but I'm looking now. It seems to have not get full throttle. Look at this friends, watch, watch, watch the throttle. Okay, that's cranked. It Look, bang, cranked, wide open, boom. Okay, but here, I'll hold it with this hand. Watch this. There's like, now the only way to, the only way to know if that's doing anything is fire it, hold it wide open and go like that. Whack, whack, whack. It's the only way that I know I'm getting full throttle. They may have it designed. If it doesn't change in RPM, then it's fine. Somebody asked me in the comment section yesterday after I did the low jet um, thing there. People people who don't <clears throat> know pipes and worked with pipes, they always think they're buzzing up too high or the saw's running lean or something. Pipes are different, friends, than, than just a muffler. They're much different. It takes a bit to get to learn them, to tune them. You have to really engage and get in. Um, the plug on that saw is still dark brown. On that, on that Donnie Walker saw. So you're wondering, it's not lean, but pipes do 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 screw with guys' tuning abilities. Um, they're different animals. Here, a fella asked in the comment section, Bucking, could you do a high jet thing? Well, this is it right here. And this goes with every freaking two stroke power saw you'll, you'll ever put in your hands. This is the program. But remember, this is just on the bench. This is not in the wood. But I know this saw a little bit already because I've played with it a small bit and I know that it's set pretty nice. You'll hear it buzz up like almost like you can turn that high jet in, hold it wide open. You can turn the high jet in and it will stop running. It'll go and it'll just run out of fuel. But then you let it off and the low jet kicks in and it'll run. So they're two different circuits, but they do share some, some pie together. So here you'll watch me right now. I'll go, I'll wing it way up and then I'll back it off into a four stroke. 
The only reason I use this four stroke or a gurgle or a burble, people on the internet understand what is four stroking. Well, I, I guess that's what four stroking is, the gurgle below the scream. Now it still could be lean. I will not know this until I get in the wood and it could be fat, but I don't believe it's fat. I think it's actually almost right on. <laughs> So this thing, it sounds good. It always sounded good and strong. It's got lots of compression. I think that's how them fellas build their saws. It, it, it is a thumpy saw. I, I don't, so it was tuned fine. It, it was tuned fine. You heard how it went up there. Eh? It sung up and then I, I cracked it back. <laughs> It, it was tuned good, but I, I cut a great big tree down with it one day, a balsam, and I actually struggled with it. I'll be quite frank. I don't know why. Um, it, it, I don't know why, but I, I really like Rattler, buddy. I love you. You're a friend, and, and it's different because, friends, these are two different builds completely. This is machine, like machine work build, whereas... Friends, this is the saw that they sent, some guys sent, a group of them sent to me to say that it would it would eat my 394's lunch money. And it did not do that. I'm not saying it's not strong, it's, it's a strong saw. The video's there, you can see what happens. As the wood got bigger, the 394 kind of edged, edged ahead. But they were, it was similar in the cuts in, in normal wood. So it should be, you would think it would be. So Rattler buddy, this is a good strong saw. I just haven't had a lot of time on it. I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fix this. Look it, I need to show you this. I'm gonna talk to my buddy Rattler. Right now, I'm gonna talk to him. I'm gonna give him a message. I talk to him all the time. Well, not all the time, but quite a bit. So look, watch what happens. See right there, see that little tab? Here, let me point it out to you. Right there, you can see it, it's on the intake. Right there, that little tab? Watch what happens. Watch, full throttle, boom. Look it, okay? So. It's not hitting there, but yet, shaklank. So I don't know. I don't know these saws. I'm gonna check it. This has got it. You'll see that ridge there. It rides on that little hump and just gets it up that little bit right there. Good. Thanks, buddy. 288, Rattler. This ain't a race, it's a comparison. That 86 is nuts.
Mm -hmm. A very busy day today. And, uh, but you know what? I like to get content out for you to watch. So what that was, friends, obviously, um, is not a, um, it's, it's a comparison. It's not a race. It's a comparison video because you can't race and, and do true comparisons unless you're using the same chain. So, so what that is, is that that's Rattler saw, which is basically a stock chain on that thing. Stock, uh, full house though. It, EXL, nice cut and chain. That chain, that saw strong friends. He's up against the Iron Horse 371 86er with a pipe and a ground chain. That 86er's got canaches. It just does. So this, this is just to give ideas. Um, Iron Horse has built, built the strongest saws I've ever run. Just... Hands down, that, that just, just <laughs> um, Iron Horse, you got to remember, friends, the old Iron Horse, he's been around a long time. So was Rattler. Rattler builds a lot of saws. I don't know what, uh, what's been done to that saw, but if you listen very closely, friends, to these two saws at idle, you will hear something. <laughs> almost sounds like a gear drive there's a, there's a there's a buzz to them you can hear them listen closely go back and watch friends this is the the most they start at the same time i take time when i do these little side by sides i do i, I make sure it's even in the way i cut like one you'll notice i'm dogged in but loading the saws the other one is just straight going at it So these are just to give the mind something to, to, to work on, to understand that Iron Horse builds a nutty saw and this 288 is strong. It's strong, very strong. And it's got no pipe. You see what I mean? So don't think for a second, pipes don't make saws go faster. They do, especially if you get the, the formula right. The uka hoopus. You get that right, it's going on like that ram horn. I don't know what happened there, but we nail it. We nailed it. That thing is Pavarotti, right? Which is a much smaller saw than those two saws. Now that would be an interesting race, wouldn't it? Same chain, just swap swap out chains. You know, where you go. So this is it for today's video. I got a roll. I'm halfway through packing my axes, handles. She passed halfway of, of, of shipping axe handles. So folks that have bought an axe handles, thank you. We're gonna reopen it up again after I get these caught up, because you know how that'll work, right? If I just keep taking orders until they're sold out, you will wait longer, so from purchase date, right? So, one, two, three, four, five, six. I sent out six boxes yesterday. Everybody's got their tracking numbers. Woohoo! Then we send out another, probably tomorrow, I'll send out another, uh, or today, we'll see what happens, but I don't think today, because I got an appointment in town. We're getting there. Friends, I love yous. Let's, let's keep power saws and love and the joy and the fuzz and the, and the, and the wonder and, and of the power saw, what it does for us men and women and children. Let's keep it a good thing. Because it really is, it has saved out so many men. The forestry industry and the power saws, simple, simple, humble labor with, with this machine has pulled so many men out of the bite and salvaged so many men, me included. So I don't understand the rest of this, this jargon that goes on. I, I, I don't understand it, friends. No mulberry bush here. I love yous. Work hard. Be honest. Help freaking somebody out. Be kind. See you on the next one.